A Utah man lost tens of thousands of dollars in cash somewhere in Weber County, and then amazingly, he got it back, thanks to three honest men who knew they had to do the right thing. New specialist Alex Cabrero has a story of a Christmas season he will never forget. So was it just right out here on the main road? Many parents have that one kid who just loves pranks. For Lori Hickman, it's her son, Rhett. He has that personality. Sometimes you don't quite know if he's telling, you know, he just likes to egg me on a little bit. So when Rhett came home this morning telling his mom a sheriff's deputy was coming over because he found a lot of money. And I'm like, you did not. I just know Rhett's personality. I just thought he was teasing me. And he's like, I did. I really did. Sure enough, at this West Haven intersection, Rhett and his two friends saw a box with lots of envelopes in the middle of the road. So they stopped to check it out. We didn't know until I kicked one of them and money flew out. A lot of money. Somewhere between 45000 and fifty, maybe. It's a rough guess. We didn't actually count it. We just kind of looked at the envelopes. They had written $10,000, eight, four. And all of it was cash. I've never seen that much cash ever, especially sitting in the rows. So it was kind of crazy to just see it sitting there. Without hesitation, though, all three of them knew they couldn't Lost keep it. it. The first reaction was like, well, let's get this to the right person. Then after, we're like, dang, could have done a lot with that. <laughs> a Weber County Sheriff's deputy came over to claim the cash. The three men joked about what they could have done with all that money. Uh, uh, this would pay off a lot of loans I got. <laughs> but I was like, oh, we better do the right thing and give it back. So Even pranksters have a living. That's a huge temptation, but I'm really proud of all of them. Now, I spoke with the Weber County Sheriff's Office, and they told me they had a man call them this afternoon saying that he lost a whole lot of money, and he couldn't believe it, that someone found that money, and even that they turned it in. He was able to identify the box that the money was in and everything. He is planning on meeting with the boys tonight for a big old thank you and a reward. Alex Cabrero, KSL 5 News. Oh, can you imagine? No. Good people out there, yeah, though. Yeah, that great, is good for reaffirming. Them. Yep.